Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a song into Easy Worship when it may not be in Song Select. Now, I want to tell you if this song, if it's in Song Select, you want to use that process, check that other video out. But sometimes there's songs that's not in Song Select that you need to add. Now, we're going to take a simple song uh, like Amazing Grace so that I don't have to go through a big lengthy process. Sometimes uh, lyrics of songs are a little more difficult to find than others. But first you just go down open up your web browser and I simply usually just search out the lyrics like Amazing Grace and then as you can see you know as, as typically does it pops up kind of helps you out there and so I'm looking for that uh, the lyrics so we're going to click on that and we come up uh, comes up with of course the browser uh, uh, different things. Uh, Hymnal.net is a good place to uh, download lyrics. Now I want to give you a little warning. Uh, it varies, but some places, some websites that have song lyrics will play. Sometimes it's an instrumental of the song. Um, could be even the song uh, with vocals and someone singing. So you may want to make sure if you're doing this in a service that your computer is muted over here. Mute your computer or have it muted on your soundboard uh, so you don't disrupt something. But open up, for example, hymnal.net is a good one, uh, a good place to get lyrics. And so you simply just open it up. As you can see up here, this has a play bar. I've muted, but this song is actually playing, uh, you know, uh, back here uh, in the back. You know, it would be playing over the sound system were it not muted. Uh, but you want to basically just, uh, you know, come down here and you want to... Uh, to uh, you want to left click right here and drag and make that first verse blue and then just right click and copy those words and just move back into easy worship in the same way that we did with song select you want to right click in here and select new song as an option now when this happens you see right here once you you need to pay close attention to you see these faded words label and song the difference here is that where it says label that's what your tag will be you'll, you'll make that like verse one verse two etc so you want to paste those lyrics have your cursor blinking over song the word song and then right click and just paste uh, and there you have it and just uh, just that simple and then you can tag or name this verse 1. Now, in order to add the second verse of the song, you just simply move down to this plus, click it, and do the same thing you did for those lyrics. Go back to the website, go to verse 2, and drag and, and highlight this text. Right click to copy. And then move back into Easy Worship. Remember, don't paste it in the label part. Paste it in the song part. Paste. And then we'll name this verse 2. And this is simply what you do. If this were to be the chorus, we would name it chorus, tag, ending, uh, refrain, so on. Whatever it needs to be, you can add. And you also want to make sure that you title the song. It won't allow you to save it unless you do, so you're going to title it Amazing Grace or of course whatever the song you're um, uh, adding. You'll give it that title. Now I'm not going to add this song because we already have it in our um, in our system or in our, our song library. But in order for me to save this song, I'd simply click OK right here. And it will add that song to the library down here with the rest of these songs. So I hope this helps.